I want to start by saying thank you for your patience and cooperation during the first full week of school. Teachers and campus staff have shared with me how appreciative they are for your understanding while you waited patiently, sometimes in a line, as we prioritize security and take extra care to check in visitors. When possible, try to arrive early or notify the school ahead of your arrival to check out your child. This will help reduce the wait at the front office. Extra care checking in guests is just one of a number of security measures in place to protect you, your children, and our staff. Remember that you can report issues or concerns to the Northeast tip line, as well as call the non-emergency NEPD line on your screen. Watchful parents, students, and staff reported a number of concerns this week using these communication channels. Each report was fully investigated and resolved. We thank you for bringing these concerns to our attention. This week, for the first time since 2019, the Texas Education Agency released statewide accountability ratings. I'm proud to announce that our district received an overall score of 89, and we eliminated DNF campuses. This is a testament to the hard work you, your children, and your teachers have put in over the last two years. I want to thank you for your efforts to keep schools open to ensure that our children stayed in classrooms with their friends and teachers. Your partnership is critical to a successful school climate. As your child's first teacher, you instilled in them a love of learning early on, and you have an opportunity to continue to support that learning as a volunteer. Parents, grandparents, relatives, retirees, and community members have made a lasting impact as volunteers in our schools. Many of them have fond memories of volunteering that they share with me when I meet with them. You have the opportunity to create your own memories. I want to encourage you to get involved in your neighborhood schools this year. As we have done for more than a decade, all volunteers must pass a criminal background check before they can volunteer on a campus. Visit the link below to download the criminal history record check form. The options to volunteer are numerous. You may have noticed some of our watchdogs, short for dads of great students, helping during morning drop-offs and afternoon pickups. You may have seen your neighbors in the cafeteria helping out during the lunch hour or making copies in the front office. Share with us your talents and our schools will find a place for you. Remember, if you'd like to view any of my previous messages, you can access those on the superintendent webpage. Thank you for watching. I'll see you around the district.